Oh, the weather outside is frightful, but the fire is so delightful. And since we've no place to go, let us know, let us know, let us know. It doesn't show signs of stopping, and I bought some corn for popping. The lights are always way down low. Let us know, let us know, let us know. Oh, greeting people of the interwebs. Don't mind me, I'm just roasting my chestnuts on an open fire. <laughs> ah! Oh my god! Ah! <sighs> <sighs> Smells like Christmas. You know what's the greatest thing about Christmas? Well, if you're religious, you'd say that Jesus' birthday, when he was born on the manger. Hey, hey Mary, hey, did you know that your baby boy would one day walk on water? It's, it's pretty lit. Yeah, you know, it's like watching Luigi scuttle in the air, but on water. If you're not religious, you'd say the spirit of giving and togetherness. And I guess you could say the same thing if you were religious, but do you know what the worst thing about Christmas is? The spirit of giving. Now hold on, hold on, hear me out, hear me out. Let me explain. Before you start asking the what do you mean questions, but trust me, I have a valid reason why I say the spirit of giving is the worst thing about Christmas. By the way, this is an episode of Robot Analysis. I don't know if I said that yet. Think about it. If you think Christmas is the spirit of giving, the person is expecting to give something to someone. It doesn't take a genius to think that if one person is giving, one is planning to receive. In this situation, I have two reasons why I don't like this concept. One, it's materialistic. We're expected to give and receive a present when the true meaning of Christmas is the ones I've already mentioned earlier. Personally, I do find it great to receive. It feels nice to be given a gift, but I'd rather be the one to give a gift than the one to receive one. It's weird to have everyone pass gifts around and I don't even have one to pass because I'm a broke person. We have an obligation to just give to people and it makes the gift and the kind gesture lose all meaning. Two. Why only on Christmas? Why are we only giving gifts on Christmas, birthdays, or anniversaries? Practically on every special event going on, we give gifts. Why can't we just give a gift just because? We can make a gift without spending any money. Ooh, my chestnuts are done. Mmm, perfect chestnuts. <clears throat> Ooh. Is it, is it getting hot in here or is it just me? Yeah, no, it can't be me. It, it can't be me. I'm not hot. Huh. Guess I'll die. Eh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, do I have any, do I have any fire on my shirt? Alright, great, great. By the way, why is Christmas so cliche? Especially in movies. All I see are shows and movies either about the whole man, you gotta save Christmas or the whole family comedy going through Christmas concept. Where's the movie where one of Santa elves gets angry for being a slave and overtakes the North Pole? So it's up to you and another more attractive girl to um save Christmas. Huh. You can't you can't really work around that plot well, huh? Despite that, that's all I see that's going on. Forget about Thanksgiving and how much we ate and crap. Christmas is where it's at. To wrap this episode up, because I it is Christmas and I really want to spend time with my fam. <coughs> <clears throat> Try and focus your mind on the togetherness of Christmas. Forget about the gifts and the materials. Think about how Christmas brings families together. Now you can also think about New Year's Eve next week and how big of a hangover you're going to get. Or about the people who celebrate Kwanzaa or Hanukkah because Christmas is not the only holiday out there. I wonder why there's so many Christmas decorations and not Hanukkah decorations. I mean, I see Hanukkah decorations around now, but like there's a lot more Christmas decorations than Hanukkah decorations. I want to see a Christmas tree covered with dreidels and menorahs, and a menorah covered with ornaments and Christmas spruces, I guess. Thank you guys for watching this short episode. I wanted to do something longer, but it's it's a it's a <coughs> it's a Christmas. Go click on the left and right boxes to see the two most recent breakdown episodes. One about dating and the other about voting. Enjoy a holiday and stay safe, guys. I got an end of the year video. I'm excited to share with you guys coming out on New Year's Eve. So hang tight while I bid you all adieu.